Hello, this is Oli PC Guru. In this video, I'm going to show you how to convert your Windows 10 Enterprise LTSC to the latest available version of Windows 10 Pro. Let me show you this is Windows 10 Enterprise LTSC. Go to About, My PC. I scroll down. This is Windows 10 Enterprise LTSC version 1809. I'll be converting this to Windows 10 Pro to the latest available version. So the first thing to do is to go to your favorite web browser. For me, I'll be using Microsoft Edge. Search for Windows Media Creator Creation 2, I mean. Click this, download Windows 10. Click download tool now. Download the tools needed to create the ISO file we need for later. Open file, the media creation tool. Click yes to accept the program running. This will take some time, so please be very patient for the getting a few things ready. Click accept the agreement. Now wait again. This will take some time. Select create installation media, USB, flash drive, DVD, or ISO file for another PC. Click next. Keep the default language and your architecture. Click next. Select ISO file. Click next. Now save your file. I name it Windows 10. Click save. Now let your PC download Windows 10. This will take quite a lot of time, so please be very, very, very patient. Now it verifies your download, so it will take some time, so be very, very, very patient. Now it creates the Windows 10 media, aka the ISO. Please be patient while this is being created.
now the iOS O file is completed. We can now close by clicking finish and allow the setup to clean. This will take some time, so be very patient. Now the media creation tool is closed. You can now close the browser. The next step is to run some commands, which is this line of command. I'll be giving this command in the description, so don't worry so much about the commands. I'll copy this command, this first line of command. Then I go search, type power shell. Then right click on Windows PowerShell, run as administrator. Click yes for the user account control. Then allow the window PowerShell to load. Then right click to paste the command. Press enter to set the command. This will change the registry to trick the Windows setup to install Windows 10 Pro. You can now close the PowerShell. Go to the folder where you downloaded the Windows ISO. Go to File, Explorer. If you're able to see Windows 10 ISO in the recent file, click that to mount the ISO. Then click Setup to run the setup. Click Yes for the user account control. Allow the Windows setup to load. This will take some time, so be patient. Click Next. Allow it to get updates. This will take some time, so be patient. Now the updates are installed, but Windows setup need to restart for them to work. This will take some time. Allow it to restart. The installer should be restarting, so be patient. Click that if necessary. Now the Windows setup is updated. Click accept. Now let it run to get updates. This will take some time, so be patient. Very patient. Now you are reaching to the make sure you are ready to install. This will take some time, so be very patient. Now you get ready to install. To recap, you have chosen to install Windows 10 Pro, keep personal files and apps. This will retain your data and your apps and games. Click install to get ready the installation process to Windows 10 Pro and to the latest version, which is 2H22. Click install. Now you hit the Windows 10 install screen. This will take some time, so be very patient.
Hello, you missed this The PC restarts. So be very patient. This will take some time. Now it works on the update, so please be patient while the computer restart several times. Now the system is loading to the desktop. This will take some time, so be very patient. And we reach the desktop. Let's go to about PC. Go to about your PC. It says Windows 10 Enterprise and the version is 22H2. Now for the final step to go to Windows 10 Pro. Open command prompt. Now we're going to copy the second command. We shall change the Windows key to Windows 10 Pro key, which the change pk.exe slash product key and the key to Windows 10. Right click to paste the key, the command. Press enter. Allow the UAC control. After which, restart your PC. This will take some time, so be very patient. Now, go to search about your PC again. Open these settings with the about your PC. And there you have it, Windows 10 Pro on the latest available version which is 22H2. Congratulations, you are moved from Windows 10 Enterprise LTSE to Windows 10 Pro on the latest version. Without losing your data and games and apps and settings, I hope you enjoy this tutorial video. Please like, share and comment on my video and please do subscribe to my channel. I hope to see you soon again in another video.